Hey love bugs, welcome into the channel you guys. I hope y'all are having an amazing, amazing day. Let me get this right a little bit here. There we go. All right, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Let's go ahead and get into it. This is gonna be your short and sweet. So let's talk about it. Thank you angels and spirit gods most high. Give me the energy please for this short and sweet. Short and sweet, Holy Spirit. What is the message? Show me clearly, Father God. What is the message for this short and sweet? All right, guys. Let's see. Ooh, okay. The Seven of Wands. Okay. This is someone who's on the defense or you're doing something alone or you feel like someone's having to defend themselves, okay? Or you're protecting something or you could be protective over someone or something, okay? Seven of Wands, that's Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Ophiuchus energy, okay? And we have the Hermit, okay? So God is about to highlight something about whatever that feeling is that you came to this reading with, okay? That either you're on the defense, you're protecting something, um, you're defending yourself or something like that, okay? Or someone's defensive, Maybe this isn't you. I'm not sure what whose energy is what yet, but let's get into it. We got Virgo energy out here with the Hermit, okay? There's also some Sage energy with that Hermit, all right? We have the Five of Cups, okay? And we have the Star. Oh. Father God, what is this message about? So let me look. Somebody on the defense here or protecting themselves. Then we got the hermit highlighting someone's disappointment or sadness. And we have the star. Somebody for one, you could have defended yourself. There could be two people in the on the defense. You could have defended yourself against somebody else who's acting defensive currently. Okay. You could have defended yourself against somebody else who's acting defensive. It looks like with the hermit here, God is highlighting somebody's feeling disappointed or sad or someone's shedding some tears about you. Okay, the star. Judgment. Okay, so somebody here is receiving some type of karma. God's lighting somebody's earth up okay god's lighting somebody up sorry y'all my head is itching okay so god is lighting somebody up it's like he's scolding someone and it's like he's scolding them and they're disappointed yeah ace of pentacles that's a yes card so he's scolding somebody somebody's receiving karma they're in trouble all because of something they did to you now, they could be on the defense about all of this, okay? Somebody could be like, I'm getting a vibe. This is what I'm getting. Let me just tell you what I'm getting, okay? I'm sensing that there's somebody who is like acting out, okay, or upset. And they could be, like, they could have been lying on you. They could have been um, just spreading rumors. Somebody could have been just talking out of the side of their neck or just talking about you. I'm hearing obsessively. Okay, obsessively. Um, but they could have just been had had your name in their mouth. Ranting. I'm hearing ranting. Okay. And God is like the whole reason they're doing this is because they're upset that you're the star, and they're receiving some type of karma. A path is opening up for you. So somebody done found out what it is. Is somebody okay? That's what you need to know. Somebody done found out that you are winning <laughs> in whatever shape, form, or fashion, however winning looks to you, okay, or you're abundant, or you're receiving some type of honor or recognition, okay, and it, it's made them, like, you're surprised about this, like, you're even going to be shedding tears. It's going to be like something's about to come through that's going to even make you shed a tear or two. I'm getting a vibe like this woman, as God is exposing this or revealing this, okay, this woman is like, like, it's as if he's showing her, like, 
this is what you get, or this is your reward, or this is your land, or this is your property, or here's what I have for you. That's the vibe. It's like God is taking a woman by the hand, or this doesn't have to be a woman, it could be a man, but he's taking this person by the hand. We're saying that God is in this energy, and he's showing this person, like revealing them to them. He's revealing it not only to you, but he's revealing it to whoever this is that's disappointed, that's on the defense, that's ranting, okay? He's showing it. He's revealing it. Like, you see this abundance I have for you? You see this opportunity that I have here for you? I, I got this for you. God got, he got this for you. You're going to hear about somebody's karma? Somebody thought they got away with something that they did to you. They thought they got away with it. And I feel like the reason they feel like they got away with it is because they didn't see any repercussion. They didn't see any consequence right away. They didn't, they didn't get that judgment right away, okay? But with the five of wands, they got it now though, okay? They got it now. Something's like, something wasn't set in stone as it relates to you. Maybe this abundance or this reward or whatever this honor or recognition is that you're receiving, it wasn't set in stone before now. And now it's set in stone. And God is like about to reveal it to you. Like, now I can show you this. God could have been keeping this a secret from you. Like waiting till the, the proper time to reveal this to you. Why is the five of wands here? The eight of pentacles, the knight of swords. Somebody's angry about this contract. The ten of cups and the four of cups. This is someone from your past. Six of cups is hiding. So someone from your past is hiding something from you or hiding that they're on the defense. Okay, because whoever this is, that's the point I was making. They're on the defense, but they're trying to act like that's not why they're pissed off or that's not why they're defensive. They want, to, they want people to believe that it has nothing to do with you when in essence, it has everything to do with you. And that's what God is going to reveal to you. Confirmation with whatever that noise is. Something about an Amazon package. That's one of the Amazon cards backing up. So the Eight of Pentacles and the Knight of Swords. So, so whoever this is, they, they were in competition or they compare themselves to you a lot or... But I feel like it's like comparing apples to how they say apples to oranges okay or let's say a fruit to a vegetable apples to potatoes or something like that it's like there's it's not the same so they shouldn't compare that y'all are not the same okay well, who, whatever this is y'all are not the same so you're being given poured into or given this abundance you're being shown some type of love from the universe or from god and it's like someone else is they're receiving karma and they're feeling rejected it's like i'm getting two ends of the spectrum here i feel like the scales are being balanced there's some type of justice energy that's here on one end of the scale you have someone who is reaping good karma and and reaping the harvest and and receiving abundance and love and support and being poured into and all the high vibrational things and then you have someone on the other hand that's like being rejected and they're receiving karma and they want to blame you for it and then they want to throw a tantrum and then they want to act like the tantrum they're throwing has nothing to do with you. But deep down on the inside, if they were to be honest and open about their feelings at this time, this person's tantrum or their outlash or um, their outburst, their anger, they're triggered and it has everything to do with you and what God has revealed to them that you're about to receive from the hand of the divine. Because the Ace of Pentacles, that's something that's being given directly to you from God, okay? Can't, ain't no man gave you this, okay? This this Ace of Pentacles, it's outreached from the heavens. It's coming from the divine, okay? We got the Queen of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. This has to do with some type of finances, abundance, um, stability, some type of support, something, something secure, um, this could be wealth, fortune, 
Um, this could be some other form of abundance, love, support. Doesn't have to be monetary is what I'm saying, okay? But you're definitely receiving that and it's been a long time coming and maybe even whoever this is that was competing with you tried to slow it down or delay it. So something about a masculine, this has to do with a masculine because that was the emperor, either a masculine or an Aries is significant. We have the eight of swords, the ace of cups and the four of swords. Yeah, it's like with the eight of swords, somebody was trying to block it or stop it or, or trap you or bound you in some type of way. Somebody wanted to inflict some type of fear onto you so that you wouldn't receive this opportunity or this contract, this job, this raise. Some of you guys could be getting promoted. A couple is significant, the Ace of Cups, but instead it's like this, it's like somebody, they thought they had it all planned out. Like, yep, I'm going to do this. I'm going to tell people that. And then when they found this person through, you know how if you tell a kid, you tell a kid something and they expect that to happen. They're like, okay, we're going to go to, we're going to go to Chuck E. Cheese on Saturday. Okay. And then something comes up and you got to go to that kid and be like, look, like, okay, for example, because somebody, this could be a situation where you have, you have a child and you're co-parenting with another child, a parent. Okay. And it's, it's the other parent's time to pick up the kid. And it's like, yeah, we're going to go to Chuck E. Cheese. And then you go to, um, you know, the, it's the day of it's Saturday and we're going to Chuck E. Cheese and the kid gets up, they're excited. And then like the, the parent gets called into work or something. It's like, if there's a level of devastation, it's like a kid, it's somebody is throwing there and a kid will show out. Okay. Like I, uh, we were going to Chuck E. Cheese. Okay. McDonald's. Okay. However, <laughs> like a kid will throw a straight, throw a temper tantrum. Somebody is throwing a temper tantrum because they thought that either they were going to receive something. They thought they had blocked something. They thought that their plan worked. They thought something. And whatever they thought, it's like they're being shown by the parent figure, which is God in this case, the divine, like, oh, nah, we can't go there. You're not, you not, we going, but you can't go there. Something like, it's like somebody's being denied. Oh, I just heard somebody's being denied the kingdom of heaven. My nose itched with that. I'm hearing in the glory and abundance that comes with it. Somebody's being denied a seat to the throne. We have the lovers. You're being shown like favor, balance, protection. It's like God is showing you, hey, I'm the one that protected you from this. I wonder what this person was doing for real. Well, we know they was trying to slow it down. We know they was in competition with you. And we know that you had to defend yourself against this person. God is like, come on, I'm taking you out of all of that. It's going to make some people sad. It's going to make some, you, 